Hey everybody, I randomly challenged Min to a match. He, I don't think he knows I'm recording it, so I'm excited about that. Ooh, I just hit myself in the face with a cord, trying to plug in my audio. All right, I got the audio in, I'm ready to go. I picked my deck, we'll see what Min picks. I'm waiting for him to select a deck. I think this is working. We're only playing one match, because he's got a lunch. So I'm going to go at him with my rogue, or rogue, warlock. And he's coming at me with who knows what. Let's see. I bet it's um, his druid. But he doesn't know that I know that he knows. I should have played as my druid. That would have been funny. Mirror match. Would have, would have rocked, his, rocked his socks. Okay. Oh, he's playing rogue because he knows that I hate it. Or maybe because he's trying to handicap himself. Um, mulligan those guys. Oh, not so bad. Okay, he's still choosing. Good luck. Or how he, oh, cool, just with enter. <laughs> All right. I could soul fire, but I'm not going to. And turn. Let's see what Min does. He's got his uh, coin. He's a rogue, which his hero power is that he has one, two daggers. Well, no, Eric's chatting me too. Everybody's chatting me. It's a chatty day. Oh, I love that. I love that card. <clears throat> Normally, you can't really talk to anybody, but. Um, thanks to the magic of the internet, I can, so. We'll see what I do next. I might go Ogre Brute, because it's pretty strong, and I don't need the 1-1 one, one buff for a Haunted Creeper. Although that's not so bad. Then I have a 3-2. I don't know. We'll see what Min does. But he can always, at any time, really kill something with 1 damage. Oh, no! I hate that card so much. Hello, hello, hello. All right, let's see. I think he's playing, <laughs> is this your mech deck? Oh, I'm gonna spell it all cool. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go cleric. Come on, put your little effect. Got a little lag. Oh, it's disconnected. Okay. All right, now a stupid thing is stupid. It's less stupid. Let's see what he does. He's probably just going to attack Gul'dan. Gul'dan. Golden. As we start getting higher in... In... Uh, in uh, <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> um, let's see what he does. He's going to trade for that, which is not a bad choice. Because now he has a spare part. Let's see what he... Because he could throw out a spare part now. Um, we'll see what he chooses. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Um, so the Annoyotron is actually <laughs> kind of one of my favorite cards because it's so fucking annoying. It's like, hello, oh, well, hello. Oh, well. All right, see, the dagger comes out and he's coining up. So his weapon has plus one attack. And there goes the, uh, the spider. And then he took one damage. Okay, uh, I'm going to hit him. I'm going to play a Brute. Um, next turn, I'm going to play the Belcher. I don't want to take a chance, because this is a good card, but it'll have to discard one. I don't want to take a chance of losing it. So He can kill it this turn if he wanted to, but 
he'll be looking at potentially Goblin Auto Barber. I love it. That's pretty great. And it's, I think, a rogue card. So two damage, and now his hero's going to hit me. And now his three guy's still alive. Oh, he's got another one. So when that guy dies, he summons a two-cost minion. All right. I have five mana. So if I call this guy, I get plus one spell damage, but I can't cast that spell too. I can cast that one, though. But I don't need more than four damage. I'm going to play my Sludge Belcher and see what he does. He doesn't have a weapon anymore, but he could still... That's one damage, four damage, eight damage. Like He could take this guy out. Yep, there he goes. Assassinate. Boom. He still has to take out this guy, but he's not that strong, comparatively speaking. So now he still has the four damage that he can deal with that guy. So I'm going to pull out my Dread Infernal. So I take out that guy for free, almost. And now he's down to two health. If I get... Um, I have a card that buffs demons. If I get that, I'll be golden. Because I'll be able to give him like plus five, plus five. Which is pretty sweet. But he also has cards that'll enable him to just take out um, my guy. So like he might buff his weapon again. And then take out my Infernal with a combination of stuff. Yeah, here it comes again. So he just called out a... Oh, but he can't use that battle cry, so... All right, so... I have two soul fires. Uh, what I'm going to do is... Take out this guy. Pull out that. It doesn't matter, though. But next turn, if I wanted to, I could play that card and then I have free soul fires that are plus one damage although he can take out my ogre mage fairly easily does that card actually hurt him this is give your weapon plus one attack so I don't know all right so now he's gonna kill it with this guy all right uh eight health to his hero but that's okay he's got his dagger again we can't use it at the moment so, I'll play this guy, and then I could lose that if I play this. I'm going to take my chance. Yep, I did lose it. So much for that. That's like not the card to lose in that case. He's got the one damage, and he's got who knows what in his hand that he can deal with this guy. He's not that powerful. Spider tank. I can take out the spider tank pretty easily, though, because I only have to use one mana to do it. Um, so we'll see what he does. And I only have one card, so I can play a card, soul fire, and potentially life tap as well. If you have a mech, he got a spare part because of that. So he's more dangerous than this guy, so I might use it on him, actually. He's got two mana, and he's got two two or three spare, car spare parts, so we'll see what he does. He equips another dagger. Okay, Lothub. Yeah, sure. Make his shit more expensive next turn. Life tap. Get this guy out. Alright, so any spell that he wants to cast next turn is going to cost 5 extra mana. So, like, his removal spells, which normally are going to be around 3 or 4, are now going to cost 8 or 9. Which, it doesn't mean that he can't remove my guys, but it just means it's going to be harder for him to do it. Um, and he's not going to be able to play like other things at the same time. So we'll see what Min does. <laughs> so he's going to use the tank to get rid of my... Um, my guy. Now he has the, the, that guy out. He's got two of them. He's got another dagger. Yeah, he pretty much had to summon demons that turn, or demons, minions that turn, because he couldn't really do anything else to me. So we'll do this to get another card. Uh, we'll break his weapon, because why n No, we're going to go plus one, because now we're at 12, 13 damage. We're going to force him to, uh, to do something big, because now he's down to two health. So 
So now he's got to deal with these guys. You know, he's got to deal 8, 6, and 8. That's 12, 14, uh, 20 damage if he wants to clear me off the board and not die. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, and he's got four cards. Two of them are spare parts. And spare parts uh, have little tiny effects that are uh, kind of neat. I think uh, I think he's playing on his iPad too, and that's why we have like the little caps. So we'll see what he does. Yeah, so Apple Mini is attack and health. So he just made that guy stronger. That was one of his spare parts. So he hit me three, down to six health. He could do some damage, deal two damage from a da damage minion, and deal four damage instead. Oh man. Oh. Holy crap, that was like brutal. That was fun. That was that's a pretty cool deck. Very control. Uh, we'll see uh, what Min is. Uh, I think he's going to gotta go. But still, that was really fun. That's the first match I've played against a friend. It was tense. And uh, yeah. <sighs> First friendly. I'm glad that I saw that he was online and in Hearthstone. That that was a a lucky uh, a lucky sort of find. Uh, so thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I'll uh, I'll see you next time.